What is up, my turtles? My name is Jimmy, also known as Jimmy Stortuga, and welcome back to the Pokemon Gold Zombie Lock. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. Remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. If you are new, if you are new. I, I, I don't know. Maybe I was still thinking of doo doo at the end of last episode. <laughs> Jokes. <laughs> it's funny. Anyway, we got some super potions, which is really cool, and I got a bunch of great balls. Hopefully, we don't use a ton of them. Uh, elsewhere, but now I have no money, so if I go to Jami, I have 524 Poké Dollars when I just had 18,000, but we have six badges, which is cool. Um, so we're making, uh, we're making some really good progress. I forget what episode number this is, um, off the top of my head, uh, but it's cool. Um, I believe there is a trainer up here somewhere? And I knew there was a hidden item up here. No, there was, there's no trainer. Maybe I'm thinking of Heart Gold Soul Server, but I thought there were there were some trainers to fight over here. Um, and we'll go after that Pokeball in uh, in a little bit. Um, but yeah, and then we have the Gyarados are angry, so that's cool. So cool. All right, fantastic. So before we go encounter the shiny, well, we even before we even get close to the shiny, we get a Hoppet as our encounter for this route, which actually is species because we have jump luck, so I can actually knock this out. Because that is species clause, um, because I have a jump luck. So I actually have a feeling we might not be able to get an encounter here, which then gives us a token for something else. So if all we can find are hop-ups, because this is usually Magikarps, or maybe even Gyarados. Um, I'd have to look at the encounter table to be 100% sure. But yeah, I I think uh, I think we have to give up this encounter, and this becomes a token which we can use in another route somewhere else. Also, I realized I can just talk to this guy. And I thought he was going to give me a fishing rod, but it'll probably happen after the shiny. All right, let's get the shiny. All right, so let's see if you guys' predictions in the last episode were correct. Um, we're still running into hop -ip, so I guess that's all, all we get. That's what I was thinking. Anyway, um, so let's get it. Our shiny encounter... is a Geodude, which also technically is dupes. And Geodude is not super gold in this generation, which is kind of fun. All right. So I am still gonna catch it. Um, really no reason not to. I'm just trying to think of when the shiny Geodude becomes a golem in this. See, I, th I thought it was... Uh, I, I heard it, but I don't have headphones on. Ow, by the way. Ah, oh, you butt. <laughs> no! Ah, oh, that sucked. I completely... Di I didn't even think of self-destruct. So, when Golem... When we got Golem at level 20, it, it learned self-destruct at 21. I imagine Geodudes is very similar. Ah, oh, that sucks. And we lost Mina in the process. <sighs> no. No. That's a Mareep. That's a that's a different encounter. So we can get him a reap now. So that's cool. Ah. Uh, Oh, 
All right, we're gonna try to do the same thing here. Um, see, I've used Mareep and, in all honesty, Pichu a lot. Pichu is gonna take a long time to... to get down. Ah, uh, I didn't even get a chance to throw a ball at the shiny. I'm sad. That really sucked. I wasn't even thinking about self-destruct. It's like, usually I'm, like, right on that. Ah, oh, man. So, obviously I have a, a decision to make on, on that. On the fall of Mina. And it'll be a series first if I do decide to do it with two zombies on the team. I think that'll just absolutely kill me, though. I don't have the encounters to do that. And the thing is, is, like, I can't just swap the zombies. Like, eat, you know, have the zombie destroy the other zombie in order to survive. That's, that's, I believe, I believe that's in the rules. And even so, I'm not going to do that. All right, we caught the Mareep. Um, female, female eventual Omphoros. This will probably join the team, to be fair. Um. Uh, that really sucks. I'm gonna call her Stacy. EY. Stacy. <laughs> because why not? Hi Lance, how you doing? It's good to see you. Lake of Gyarados, blah blah blah, I'm Lance. Hello Lance, it's good to see you. I will help you investigate. Let's go. I'll be waiting for you. Okay, bye. I still have some decisions to make. <laughs> Ah, uh, Mina was such a good member of the team, too. Ah. <laughs> uh. So my question becomes... Basically... Uh, okay. Oh, uh, we have more Pokemon than I thought. Well, I mean, I guess we did get three encounters. Should have been four, but... <laughs> Yeah, here's the jump bluff, so that was species, 100%. So... So now, like I said, my, my problem... <laughs> my problem is... Here, here's the problem. Is in order to revive Mina, I have to sacrifice an existing member on the team that can't be Kenya. And pardon the... Mm -mm -mm. Yeah. Zombie mons cannot be healed unless you sacrifice a non-zombie party member. That's that's literally like rule two, like that I have written down here. So pardon the the music going away for a moment, but while I look that up. So in order to revive this, I have to sacrifice either Boulder, Harmony, Fazzy, or Yang. Also, in order to revive this, well, I have to use the Pokemon Center, which causes us to heal. Which means Kenya will take Boulder, Harmony, Fazzy, or Yang. So, as much as I want to have a second one, it's like I would have to replace two Pokemon on the team. And that's annoying enough as it is. I think we're just going to say goodbye to Mina. I just, I can't, I can't justify having a second zombie on the, on the team. As fun as it would be for content, it's like, I don't have a good backlog of Pokemon. So, we're going to add uh, Stacy to the team, uh, but I'm going to go ahead, uh, before I update the layout, I'm just going to go ahead and... Uh, and uh, get it up to par with the team, and then we'll go take on Team Rocket. So I apologize. It's like, I really wanted to, but it's like, in order to do what I needed to do, it's like, I would have had to sacrifice two members, and 
I can't. I can't justify. It's not worth it. It's just not. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I feel like I feel like I should, but I've made my decision. So let me get let me get uh, uh, Stacy up to up to par here. And here we go. Stacy the Omphoros is added to the team, added to the layout, which is really really cool. Uh, Rock and Thunder Punch, Cotton Spore, Thunder Shock, and Thunder Wave. Which is very, very cool. So, uh, once again, we'll uh, just kind of get it based on that. And again, I don't want to lead my zombie. So, um, we do have a really, really good team. Which is very, very nice. But, it's just, I do feel like we could do a little bit better. So, let's go ahead and do the thing. Hyper Beam, out. Hello, everybody. What took me? I, I lost one of my Pokemon. Whoop. The stairs are right here. We should split up. I'll go check the place first. Yep. Hi. Found the secret stairway. I did. Hello. Alright, so we got Team Rocket members that'll come after us. Hi. Intruder alert. So now time to fight some Team Rocket members, which is, you know, a f thing that we do. Ty Rogue, I'm already missing my 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 Pokemon. Alright, so let's go ahead, throw Magnitude up top, and Rock Throw. I'm gonna go ahead and Rock Throw, I'm just gonna miss apparently, because that's what I do. So Rock Throw should knock it out. Boulder is strong. Then we sent out a Poliwhirl. Boulder is also scared. <laughs> we'll go into our new members here, Stacy and Boulder. And we're gonna just say no to the Poliwhirl, even at level 19. I am quad weak and no thank you. And then Omphoros' like famous move is, is Thunder Punch, which is really, really fun. So Scribe on said no. Then we get another person at us. So it's time for the Team Rocket hideout. Hope you guys are excited for today's episode here. Um, we fight an Oddish, but I really kind of don't want to deal with that. Kenya can actually deal with the Oddish, so. Uses Absorb, that should be fine. Yeah, we're good. Then we get some powder snow. Nice. Vulpix. And now we're heading right back out. <laughs> right back to Boulder. So yeah, I, I, I feel like I, I'm not making like the best of, of, of plays here, but I'm trying to also make sure that I'm able to win the, the series. Um, so I hope you guys, I, I'm, I'm glad uh, you guys have stuck with it as, as long as you have, which is, you know, super cool and I really, really appreciate you all. Um, and we'll get through it, we got this. Harmony, and there goes, there goes Diggy, so, I'm just gonna fly, you can't do anything, and it doesn't affect me anyway, but that way I'm not wasting any, uh, any extra PP, and we take out the Diglett. Easy. Alright, so I like how they just disappear after you beat them. <laughs> Alright, I'm burned. Um, I actually feel like I did get a burn heal. I did not. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go get a burn heal um, from a Pokemart and I'll be right back. All right, we're back. Uh, I got the burn heal, and uh, we are we are cleared of the burn, which is really really good. 
Um, so we are going to grab this item, but we're going to fight the Team Rocket members that we just fought. <laughs> Alright, so I thought I had gotten Burn Heals and Paralyzed Heals, so I stocked up on that, and I even got a, uh, a, uh, what is it? an easy, uh, what, it, what is it, uh, a full heal. I even have a full heal, just in case I'm like, I've run out. But I've got two Paralyzed Heals, Antidotes, Ice Heals, Burn Heals, blah, 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 so, even after I, I, I did do that, so that is, that is really good. So... This is going to be a combination of Boulder and Stacy knocking these guys out. We're getting Water Gun. They literally have the same Pokemon, which is which is always interesting with this particular part of the game. Like, why does he bring the same Pokemon? Like, why? I mean, this makes it super easy for me to beat him, but it's like, it's... It's funny, though. It's just, it's funny. It's my turn. I'm going to... Use the same strategy I used on you before. <laughs> and then this one sent out an Oddish. Yeah. Which then we used Kenya for. Which is good. Use a Sweet Scent, but it failed. Now we're going to go down into Powder Snow. Ah. Very nice. And then it went into like Volpix or something like that, right? <laughs> and I'm just like, uh, yup, nope. And we go back into Boulder. And that's how I got burned. <laughs> but this time I'm not gonna get burned. Frat! Take that, you stupid Vulpix, for burning me a second time. I don't have the constant money to keep going back, nor do I really have the patience to do that. Bruh. And then, we went into Harmony. <laughs> this is literally a repeat of what we just did. This is deja vu. Almost deja vu. We used Magnitude this time instead of Dig. <laughs> so this time I'm gonna use Surf because I don't need to save PP. So, hey, Stacy. <laughs> Found a Firestone, but I can't carry anything else. Well, I gotta heal my burn, but again. Stop burning me. Alright, I think this is the way to go, yeah. So, if I go down in here... Do, 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 I, I can't go that way, which means I'll have to face Mr. Scientist dude here. We'll have to face Mr. Scientist dude here, but we got this. He's got three Pokemon, starting out with a bird. A twin-headed bird. But that's okay. Alright, so we go Rock Throw, it's got Pursuit, good to know. That's fine, Rock Throw. Should destroy the bird because, you know, it's a super effective move. Which is awesome. And then a Magnemite, you know what's fun about Magnemite? It doesn't have Levitate in this generation. So, it's quad weak. Bye! <laughs> Boulder grew to 31, which is fantastic. Um, and then we have a Growlithe, which will also get magnituded 7 on. Boom! Easy fights are easy. We got a good team. The problem is we still have the zombie, which I still have to keep, you know, I still have to keep uh, alive, but, you know. Surf mail? Meh. I don't need to worry about that. The Firestone? Kind of think I should probably grab that Firestone, to be fair. Do, 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 do. So, what can I, what can I get rid of for the Firestone? Repel? Um, nah. I mean, I can give two scope lenses to people. Like, you're, you're critting like crazy, so I'll give you that, and then... Let's give, let's give Stacy the scope lens. There. Cool. Fantastic. 
Now I have a Firestone. Fantastic. Also, I need to move Boulder out of the front of the party. So now Stacy gets gets a go at the beginning. Which will throw everything off, but I won't get burned. Because <laughs> like I said, I don't like putting the zombie to lead. Forget what his first mon is. Tyrogue? So yeah, that'll be fine. Alright. Uh, it's funny, it's like if you do this right, you face him... Um, four or five times? One... This is our third time we fight him one more time. Yeah, you, if you do it right, you face him five times. We, uh... We're gonna get to the end. Oh, the NPC heals us here. I just realized that the NPC heals us shortly. No. <laughs> no. No heals. All right. There's the second one there. No! <laughs> That's not good. Uh, right, we have an Oddish. So, but that's okay, because Kenya can take care of the Oddish, just as we have been. Mm hmm Sweet Scent, which means my evasiveness fails, which is fine. We get a Powder Snow, which will knock it out, which is what we like to see. Kenya's getting up there, though. And then we send out a Vulpix, of course. Um... Yeah, I mean, I can do the same thing, but I think this time we're gonna go into Harmony. Just for the super effectiveness. Miss, miss, miss. And then we'll be able to Surf. That'll knock out the Vulpix. And we have a Diglett, which I normally go into Harmony anyway for. So, easy peasy. Keep coming until you click the secret switch. Soft sand? Actually, that'll be very useful for Boulder. So let's go ahead. Let's just give somebody the Miracle Seed for now. Actually, let's give Fazzy the uh, Miracle Seed. Which will be really cool. And we'll give somebody else the Scope Lens. That I just got back. Um, let's give Yang the Scope Lens. And then we can grab the soft sand. And then we give the soft sand to Boulder. Very nice. Held items for the win. All right, second to last statue. Because we actually got one more. Tyrogue. And Stacy will be able to take out this team entirely. So this guy doesn't even get a chance to do anything. <laughs> Which is fun. Then we got Thunder Punch for Poliwhirl. Boom! Let's go! Good job, Stacy. It's my turn, there's no escape. So here's the Oddish. So we play the game, switch into Kenya. And we're paralyzed. That's no bueno. That's new. Powder Snow, we're still faster though. It's a good thing we got those uh, paralyzed heals and everything, which is very nice. Very, 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 very nice. 
Then we got a Vulpix, which we don't want to fight, so we go into Harmony. Uses Ember, of course, expected that. Alright, and then we Surf. Oh, it uses Quick Attack this time. Taking some damage. Taking some damage. And then, of course, we got Diglett, and we just surf the Diglett, and we got him. Easy peasy. We'll keep coming until you trip the secret switch. Nah, don't worry about it. All right, let's, uh, oh wait, I can't, I can't heal Kenya. I can't heal Kenya because that would require me to sacrifice a Mon, which I think I'm going to have to do anyway. <laughs> because of the heal, the forced heal upon us. Zombie Mons cannot be healed unless you sacrifice a non-zombie party member. Ah. Cool. <laughs> Marvelous. I'm going back to the beginning, and I'm going to fight these guys one final time <laughs> to end the episode. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, here's what I'm going to do in between episodes. I'm going to figure out who we're sacrificing, because obviously we're sacrificing somebody. Um, I'm not quite sure who yet, because um, I don't really have the best backlog of Pokemon. Although, we do get an encounter. Maybe I should grab this encounter here um, before, before we go. Let's see what our encounter here in this place is. Because then we get one more static as well. Um, so before we end the episode, let's see if we can get whatever encounter here is. And then I can kind of make my decision from there. Alright, so let me go ahead and do that. The good news is, is that... Um, like, Stacy is on par... I'm already paralyzed. Haha! -ha. Potter Snow, go! Stacy's on, on par with everything. It's like, I really don't want to get rid of those members. I'm trying to think, I mean, on, in all honesty, Kenya's the weakest, uh, re mainly because it is a zombie. Uh, but, like, what can I replace? I mean, obviously, Fazzy can, can be replaced. It's like, Fazzy is... Fazzy and Stacy are the ones that can be quote-unquote replaced, but the problem with Pichu is the fact that it, um... It levels up by... Um... Friendship. And I... Don't want to do that. <laughs> if I'm gonna be honest, I don't want to do that. And obviously I'm not gonna get rid of Lugia. So, I do really want to see what our next encounter is, though, because, like I said, we get a forced heal upon us, so, you know, again, it is what it is. So, let's head back down that way. We still have that one guy to fight, uh, which we'll do in the next episode, but let's head back down that way. I know this uh, episode's running a little bit long, so I do apologize, um, but let's see whatever encounter is. I never got that item. Right, because it was male. Got it. Alright, so, our encounter is... Rapidash, which is technically dupes. I can't get the Rapidash. So... 
Ah, that sucks. That would have been an amazing add to the team. Give me a Ninetales. I don't know if... Oh, that was... That was something different. Heracross. Okay. I like Heracross. I like Heracross a lot. <laughs> Jeez, I was gonna say, did that crit? That definitely crit. Well, that is not fazzy. There we go. Okay, so Heracross comes to the team. He used Endure, that's funny. Go to sleep. Heracross comes to the team pending that I can catch it. I just gotta double check its moveset, but it's like it might, uh, again, assuming I can catch it, but it's like that then potentially gets Yang off the team. Ah! Fast asleep. Because I can't do anything else here. One, two, three! Darn it! Come on, Heracross. All right, I got this, I got this though. Ready? This one's it, this one's it. Ready? Oh! Darn it. <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> Come on, Heracross, I, I really could use this encounter, to be fair. I really could use this. Oh. Only one that time. Come on, Heracross. You know you want to. You want the random moon ball, right? I don't want to give you the moon ball. Yeah, there we go. Let's go. Female Heracross. Female Heracross. We're gonna call her... Um, Riley, because why not? This one has no E. <laughs> oh, crap. I didn't think, I didn't think about that. Could have had a lick -a tongue That's fine. That's fine. All right, guys, so in the, uh, in between episodes, um, and in the next episode, obviously, um, I will go ahead and, uh, you know, try to figure out uh, what I want to do. I gotta look at uh, Heracross's level up move set and everything. Um, so I'm gonna run over to the Pokemon Center. I'm not gonna heal in the Pokemon Center, but what I am gonna do uh, before the start of the episode, uh, or at, at the start of the episode, I will go ahead and uh, switch out the the team member and just you know do it as if I did it, did it. So that way I don't have to you know run back and forth and do that. I can do that in between episodes. So. Thanks for bearing with me with this a uh, little bit of a longer episode. I know I did have a cut, but I, I know I'm over 30 minutes, so I do apologize. But thank you so much for sticking with it. Remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Glad you guys are enjoying it. And once again, thank you for the tremendous support on this series. I am I'm super happy you guys are enjoying it. Um, yeah. So guys, thank you so much, and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care, everybody. 